a few people that listen to the edification. I don't listen to, you know, sometimes when, uh, when somebody says, you know, you're not too good, you don't have to believe when you're too good, and you don't have to believe if you're down, you don't have to believe that you're too down. I don't listen uh, mostly edification. Basically, the only edification I listen is from my coach, Patrick. I'm really grateful. That edification was awesome. And uh, with call outs and shots, and uh, that was amazing. So, so thank you, Patrick. Thank you so much. Uh, but uh, we went to this event, and I remember Patrick saying, you know what, you need to go tonight, and you need to write uh, your limiting beliefs. You need to write. There is something that you have today, is something that we have that is not allowing you to go to the next level. What is that limiting belief? And I remember that night, we're in Puerto Vallarta, and I get a notepad, and I start writing, ta, ta. Like, you need to go deep. I told this to somebody yesterday to do it. I don't know if that person made it, did it. But I start writing, right? What are my limiting beliefs? What are my fears? What, what do I question? Well, you have limiting beliefs. Don't you, think, don't you agree? Say, what is it? Fear what, uh, what other people think about you? Fear of rejection, fear, what is it? And I start writing, right? What other people are gonna say, maybe fear of leading, maybe you don't feel yourself that you can lead other people, maybe you don't feel yourself that you're as good as the other person. And I started writing, ta 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 ta, I started writing. And out of those limiting beliefs, I found a couple of them. No, I didn't tell this to anybody. I was so deep that I couldn't tell this to even Ceci. I don't tell this to anybody. This is only a conversation between me and God, okay? So I start writing, and I found the limiting beliefs that I have. By the way, there are things that nobody knows that you do, or somebody, maybe you've done something, nobody, only who knows? Yeah. Only you know. You're lazy, you're afraid to call people, you're, you're actually like super lazy, like you tell everybody that you work and you don't work. Maybe you tell everybody that yes, maybe you, you stay at night watching TV, Maybe you stay at night, maybe where you're in the office, you're just watching Facebook and the computer. Maybe when you, maybe you tell them that you're doing this, maybe you tell your wife that you go to the office and you don't go to the office, you go to another place. Maybe you say stuff that you're doing, and maybe you tell your husband that you did certain, I don't know what it is, but you start, ta, 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 start you, you, I started writing, and I find out a couple of things. After finding the limiting beliefs, I found two or three that I was gonna attack. Two to three. I found two to three limiting beliefs, and I started working on that stuff, and all of a sudden I came back to the office, and I improved, and I improved. Nobody can teach you that, nobody can do that. But I believe in self-development, I believe in self-improvement. I came back, and I said, you know what? Um, if I work on this, what if this is really good for me? What if this is really my purpose in life? What is really I was made to do this business? And it becomes, became real. And I said, I'm gonna do it, I want to win. Whatever it takes, I'm gonna do whatever it takes. So we came back from Puerto Vallarta. Things started, didn't get started getting better right away. But we started improving. And I started working on my game. I started being myself. I started like being like, man, I started like really working. I was not working before. I was not putting the effort. I started being coachable. I was not coachable before. A lot of people says, you know, I'm coachable. No, you're not. You're not. You think you are, you're not. I'm telling you, I was not coachable. I used to say, you can, look, you can do lip service, but that doesn't serve you. So I said, I'm gonna start being coachable, and it hurt because I was not coachable. Patrick will say, read this book. I wanna read the book. Patrick came out with the book of book of the month. I was not reading the book of the month. So we start improving.